A couple of years ago, I saw this most spectacular sight. We were up in far northern KwaZulu-Natal at a place called Tonga Beach Lodge, a most beautiful lodge, and we came across turtle hatchlings. These little turtles are about the size of a five rand coin, and you see these little eggs break open, and these turtles instinctively know to go to the water. Along the way, the crabs begin to feast off them. Some of the turtles make it to the water's edge, escape the crabs, but then they float on top of the water for apparently about two weeks, and the birds just take them out one after the other. Those that make it through that challenge begin to sink, begin to swim, but uh, they're nice size, they're easy fodder for fish. Think about it. We've got the crabs, we've got the birds, we've got the um, fish. But have you ever seen a big turtle? For those of you who scuba dive, if you've swum with a turtle, you never ever forget that. Now, this makes me think of um, ideas. Ideas are like these little hatchlings. I need to come up with enough ideas so that one of them or some of them becomes the big turtle. Some of my ideas might be crazy, might be stupid, strange mutations, absurd, utter failures, but some of them might become that which produces magic, takes our breath away, puts us in a new league. One of the values that we adhere to in Cafe Life, one of our core values, is the value of being fresh and innovative. That means we challenge each other in Cafe Life to not come up with one idea, but to come up with many ideas. And to keep this curious mind for what else? I think that's something that we need in today's world and as we go through 2022. Don't try and perfect one idea and obsess on it. Make sure that you're coming up with enough quantity. And who knows, maybe 22 is the year you have a turtle.